Hey, what's up, guys? I got a cool video for you today. It's um, a little bit over a one minute labyrinth magic solo. And honestly, this fight could have been a lot faster if I played it a little bit differently. But I was in this fight and I was like, let's just let's just see how fast I can do this doing the god tier Aegon strat, which is you need to be over 750 hits for it to work. And I didn't do it there because I actually fucked up, but you'll see like when I don't fuck up. If she played more aggressive and I did the strat right, this could be literally under a one minute fight. It's just destruction. Look at this. So you do this and you just, um, wait, hold on, come on. You basically throw a combo and then instead of swiping back after the combo, you just keep swinging like that. And then they're going to retaliate, but since you are at 750 at combos, you have the unstoppables, so you could just retaliate against the retaliation and just get all the furies. And basically what this means is you can eat ass. I remember when this fight first came out, um, Star-Lord took like a few hundred units because of the late, the crazy limbo damage, but Aegon, sane damage, insane ability accuracy reduction. He's just so good. Six star rank three, big dickin' boy. I don't have him at 999 hits yet here because um, I flopped one of my massive combos against Colossus and it kind of screwed me, but whatever. You don't need to really be unblockable for this. It's kind of better that you might not actually, not, it, might, it might actually be better that you're not unstoppable, but that's an all I know. Is this fight could easily be under a minute, and it was barely over a minute, and I just, Aegon's so good, so yeah, running through Aegon, big dick in, killed her at the 89 hit mark, I believe, 89 hit <laughs> solo, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.